Hey y'all, I got some weird shit for y'all today. <laughs> Welcome to Flight Attendant Therapy. I am in a hotel somewhere in Tennessee. <laughs> but um, I got I was I'm watching this show right now, and you guys are gonna follow me through this, but I'm watching this show about different forms of relationships. And I'm, I've always been interested in the dichotomy of different forms of relationships, but they have these people, you know, some have like eight wives, real live women, but then they have these guys who are detached from society and they feel that they can't really um, kind of articulate their feelings or anything like that with women. So what they do, they have a relationship with a doll. And it's called um, Pygmalion or whatever, I guess, Pygmatalian or something like that, which is the art of loving, loving an object other than someone who is a live person. It is some weird shit. But anyway, this one black guy um, who's a telemarketer and he's about, about my age or whatever, but um, he's in love with this doll and he dresses her, have sex with her and he has been detached from any form of a relationship with a live woman for like five years. And then you got this guy in London who has nine dolls that he sleeps with because he feels that he really can't articulate things to say to live women. That shit is just crazy. Okay, now he wants to know why he is not um, successful with women. Okay, now the doll's name is Shadore. The guy is from Detroit. He's 37 years old. He's a telemarketer. Oh my God, look how he is all between this doll's legs and dressing this doll. This is so weird. It's on National Geographic Channel. Oh my God, he's putting leggies on the doll. Oh my God, he's been in a relationship with this doll for 10 years, y'all. Okay, y'all, it's called I Dollar. I Dollar, like they're in love with a damn doll. You know, hey, I don't know. Some people got toys and stuff, honey, you know, so maybe there'll be a, a, a toiler or an I Toiler. An I Toiler. <laughs> now, this damn show is talking about women who allow their husbands to sleep with other women, right? So it's um, it's like a swingers type situation. But she's she allows him to sleep with the woman behind closed doors while she's outside the door. You know, it's like a conditional type thing. I just don't get it. Now, child, they're inviting some friends over for dinner, and then oh, it was it was a woman that they invited over, and now the husband wants to sleep with his secretary. He's told the wife, so now the wife is hugging the secretary. They're gonna eat dinner, and then they're going into the room to have sex. I just don't understand it that. If it's, you know, I know it's Western culture, how we are, you know, we believe in monogamy and stuff like that. But I mean, this will take some getting used to, all this swinging shit and all this stuff. But you know, hey, to each his own. As long as both people can um, agree with the arrangements that they're doing, hey, and everybody is happy, let it be a, a fun fest, a sex fest. Thank you for joining us on this weird-ass episode of Flight Attendant Therapy. I am Tobias.